Hi everyone, it's Happy Mail Queen. Today I have a project for you guys and it is using Scrap Diva Designs dies. Uh, this set of dies actually is an older die set that she has in the shop and um, I believe right now it's not in stock but it is on pre-order so if you're interested I will leave the link in the description box and so make sure you hit that more word and um, you can see the full description box and I will have the link there for you guys. So again, it's um, from Scrap Diva Designs and this is it right here. This is the set of dies. It comes with um, the panels as well. So the ones with the scallop, that's the base. And then you have um, the panels. And so um, I... Uh, didn't use the sentiments right here I didn't use that um, but I did use most of the dies uh, I didn't use this one either as well as this one right here because I forgot I had this die and I think I kind of misplaced it but anyway this is the set that I used and let me show you what I made with it all right so here is my project share Ta -da! it's so cute and it holds quite a bit it is basically a little caddy to put um, hot cocoa um, things inside like a hot cocoa kit I guess you could say so um, as you can see here I used some pattern paper for the panels for all of them and I used the collection um, by Cartabella called Christmas Cheer. So this is the sticker set right here, but this is a collection that I used. And um, I also used uh, 80 pound or 100 pound cardstock right here from Michaels, I believe. Is it Michaels or Hobby Lobby? I can't remember, but it's heavyweight cardstock in um, this brown color um, because I have a gingerbread theme. And so let me go ahead and show you how the box looks like without, you know, all the decorations this is how it comes out and like I said it's very roomy and it is um, for a file folder but just to give you some ideas for Christmas crafting um, you can use it sorry I'm trying to get my camera to focus um, you can use it to carry um, all these um, hot cocoa ingredients and um, you could also, if you're not into hot cocoa, you can do cookies in here, um, which there's lots of fun sentiments um, from this Christmas cheer um, collection that have like hot cocoa. See, there's hot Christmas cocoa, homemade with love. Um, there's um, also like these kind of sentiments that you can put. Um, also like made with love with like um, these are I think these are cupcakes right or they could be sugar cookies so again this can be a cookie box this can be a hot cocoa box you could even put a Keurig this is one of my favorites right now caramel brulee by Pete's uh, coffee look it whoops it fits in there so if you're a coffee drinker you can do that you can put tea, whatever you want. So anyway, this is how it looks like assembled. This is how the box looks like. And you guys have seen this. This is not uh, new. And then this little guy right here. Um, I made this last year. And uh, yeah, this was from last Christmas. And um, it is the um, gingerbread uh, mug. I decided, you know, hey, let me go ahead and use it um, for this project. And then here, you guys know, I had shared this recently, my um, rosette, a chocolate rosette wand. Super cute, right? And it fits perfectly in there. And that's why I decided to <laughs> create this little kit because I knew that, um, you know, I can stick all of these in there and it would look really really pretty um, this is um, a candy cane and that a uh, peppermint chocolate uh, spoon that I had gotten from TJ Maxx or home goods 
So I just um, used some of my twine and yarn again and to put a little washi tape just to kind of keep it together so they can easily, the recipient can easily um, remove it. So I have that in there. As you can see, it fits a lot in here. So I also put some Giardelli peppermint bark. So as you can see, I have kind of like a cocoa peppermint theme here. And um, of course, gingerbread. So, and then the Starbucks, which I had shared these with you guys, but that's what I wanted to do. I wanted to make a little caddy for my hot cocoa ingredients. And so this is almost ready to go. I just need to, um, you know, wrap it in some cellophane and it's a perfect Christmas gift, right? So I just wanted to share that with you guys. Um, so yeah, to put this together, here we go. Here's our thing. You can put crinkle paper or, you know, some shreds in there if you want to like give it some height or or put this is nice and tall already but maybe for your other ones like for your hot cocoa so here's another one that i can put together you know if you wanted to raise this up a little bit or maybe raise this up a little bit you know you can put something below it um, but it actually fits really nicely in there and then I can just put my peppermint over here. It could be whatever you want. You know, like I said, you can make it a little cookie caddy if you wanted. But yeah, just to give you some ideas. So thanks so much for watching, you guys. And um, stay tuned. I do have a haul. I do have um, some online uh items that came from scrapbook.com and also from erica's shop that um i will share on another video that will be a haul video that is all i have to share with you guys i hope you guys have a wonderful weekend and i'll talk to you guys later bye